Welcome to the Innovative Classroom Podcast, where we explore the cutting edge of education through the lens of self-determination theory. I'm Brad Flickinger, a middle school technology teacher passionate about empowering students to take control of their learning journey. In each episode, we'll dive into practical strategies, inspiring stories, and expert insights to help you transform your classroom into a hub of creativity, autonomy, and student success. Let's innovate together. This episode is entitled Autonomy versus Dependency. In the heart of every great educational transformation lies a fundamental choice to cultivate autonomous learners or to foster dependent consumers of information. This decision carries profound implications for the future of education and, more importantly, for the students themselves. As we embark on a journey to explore the power of micro-credentials in motivating students to become self-directed learners, it is imperative to first understand the pivotal role autonomy plays in the realm of education. Autonomy is not merely a buzzword. It is the cornerstone upon which a lifelong love for learning is built. Traditionally, the classroom has often been a place where knowledge flows in one direction, from the teacher to the students. This paradigm of dependence, while effective to a certain extent, can inadvertently stifle the innate curiosity and creativity that resides within each student. The relentless stream of lectures, assignments, and examinations can sometimes leave little room for exploration, creativity, self-discovery, and genuine engagement. Imagine a world where students are not passive recipients of knowledge, but active architects of their own learning journeys. Such a world, they don't just memorize facts for the next test. They seek knowledge because they are genuinely curious, because they have questions that need answers, and because they are driven by their intrinsic desire to understand the world around them. This is the world we aim to create through the power of micro-credentials. Micro-credentials, those bite-sized competency-based certifications, are more than just tokens of achievement. They are a catalyst for autonomy. When students have the opportunity to choose which skills they want to acquire, when they can set their own goals and pace of learning, and when they have a say in how they demonstrate their knowledge, a profound transformation occurs. They become active participants in their education, not passive observers. The benefits of autonomy in learning are multifaceted. First and foremost, it nurtures a sense of ownership. When students have a say in what and how they learn, they feel a deeper connection to their education. It becomes personal, relevant, and meaningful. It is no longer a series of tasks to be completed, but a journey to be embraced. Furthermore, autonomy breeds resilience and adaptability. In a rapidly changing world, the ability to take charge of one's learning is a skill that transcends the confines of any classroom. It prepares students to face challenges head on, to seek solutions independently, and to adapt to unforeseen circumstances. Perhaps most importantly, autonomy fosters a love for learning that extends far beyond the classroom walls. When students discover the joy of exploring topics that genuinely interest them, when they realize that learning is not confined to a specific time or place, they become lifelong learners, driven by curiosity and a thirst for knowledge. In the pages that follow, we will delve deeper into the world of micro-credentials and explore how they can be harnessed to empower students to become self-directed learners. We will hear from educators, students, and innovators who have embraced this paradigm shift in education and witnessed the transformative impact it can have. But before we embark on this journey, let us remember the significance of autonomy in learning. Let us recognize that it is not just a choice, but a responsibility. A responsibility to nurture the next generation of thinkers, creators, and problem solvers who will shape the world with their knowledge, curiosity, and unwavering independence. Thank you for tuning in to the Innovative Classroom Podcast. I'm Brad Flickinger, and I hope we can innovate and improve your teaching practice together. If you enjoyed today's episode, please subscribe, leave a review, and share it with fellow educators. Remember, together, we can create classrooms where students thrive. Until next time, keep innovating.